The future of an abortion bill signed into law just two days ago by Iowa Governor Kim Reynolds remains in question tonight. Attorneys on both sides of that controversial measure are awaiting a district court judge's ruling that could come as early as tomorrow. It's our top story tonight at 10. At about the same time, the governor signed that new law into effect. Polk County District Judge Joseph Seidlin was hearing arguments from attorneys representing those in favor and against that new law. Iowa courts have previously ruled against Reynolds on that issue. The Iowa Supreme Court blocked a similar measure from becoming law in 2018. On Friday, Judge Seidlin made it clear that he would make a ruling only after much thought. If I were to rule granting the injunction right now, uh, the perception would be the same, that this judge you know, on such a serious issue uh, flippantly ruled from the bench just for expediency's sake. This issue, this case, this request requires my strong and lengthy attention. A Planned Parenthood and several other groups filed an emergency motion seeking a temporary injunction against that law, keeping it from becoming law. An attorney for the state of Iowa told the judge the fetal heartbeat bill aims to prevent the destruction of human lives, adding that the court must take those lives into account. Last week, Judge Seidlin said that he hoped to rule either Monday or Tuesday. When he does make a ruling, be the first to find out what his decision is by going to SiouxLandProud.com or watch for updates right here on KCAU 9 News.